respect the heavy division, but he took the, the fight and he was training for what? For the fitness, to be a fitness trainer. So, you know, I think I'm going to smash him, you know, and I'm going to do it for my brother. You know, this is the fight for Dillian White. And I'm, I'm not joking. You know, we're not going out to the first round. You think you end this fight inside the first round again? I mean, look, you know, last time you talked about ending Mark Bennett early. It took you a few more rounds than expected. This guy can punch. He's very sharp early on. You, you're not fear, fearful of his power. Listen, Eddie, I want to be knocked out. How can you be fearful when I want to be defeated? <laughs> I crave it. Please defeat me, somebody, please. I crave it, I want it, I love it. I want to take that fucking zero off my, my fucking uh, record. I don't like it, I don't like the zero. You take it, fuck you zero, you know? I'm sick and tired of this. Oh, you're gonna lose, yeah, of course I'm gonna lose. I lost 10,000 times in my life. I think until Dillian found me, I lost everything almost. I was out of boxing with one foot. And I, I was 28 years old. I didn't have money for bread. No, so I'm not afraid of fucking taking my zero. Knock me out right now. It's okay, bro. No, it's okay. But I wanna say one more thing. I box for the average Joe. So please, I'm gonna give you the fight. All of the average people can watch. No, I don't wanna just box for the boxing fanatics, for the boxing historians, you know, stuff like that. You will, you will value me. You know, it's just a matter of time. But this Saturday, I box for the average Joe. So please come on and support me because I'm gonna give you my all. I will not, I will not take care of myself, you know. I will be reckless. I will be, fuck, I will be reckless, you know. And I'll do it for my brother, Dillian White. And whoever has something to say about him, say it to my face or his face, or shut the fuck up. <laughs> Peace and pugilism. Fight Fanatics is Myron Magnus in another segment of Boxing Logics United. And there is Alan the Savage Babic. In the pre-fight press conference against Eric Drummer Boy Molina. And there was Alan Babic expressing his feelings about getting knocked out. He said he don't he don't like the zero. <laughs> Take it. I'm craving to get knocked out. <laughs> and you can see that. He even made Eric Molina laugh quite a bit. I, th I believe Eric Molina even enjoys his presence and his banter and his talk about the sport. And one of the things that I believe Alan Babic will be able to do is garnish the love of the casual fan. I mean, seriously, this man, as he told you a little bit of his life, he was down on the dumps. He didn't have money. He said he couldn't even buy a loaf of bread and he was 28 years old. I understand those days. But Alec Babic is not in boxing, I believe, to become a great heavyweight. He's in boxing to give us fans something that we may not be getting from, say, the greats of the day. And that's a hell of a fight. Great entertainment and just a guy in a ring who wants to just give every bit of his soul, mind, and spirit to making sure the fans are happy with spending their money. I foresee Alan Babic, actually, I foresee him being a big star, a crowd favorite, a crowd pleaser. His way of endearing himself to the media, his quite frank and open talk, and his humor, of course, just make him a very, very, very likable guy. I mean, he's only 8-0. Yes, he lacks a lot of skills, <laughs> but he just goes in there and wails away and fights like a savage. And that's what a lot of people just want. Fighters to go in the ring and give it their all. It's wonderful to see skills. Believe me, being, be myself being a diehard boxing fan. Skills is top on the list. But we also 
the average fan and myself would like to be entertained. We want to see blood and guts. You know, we don't want to see nobody hurt forever. We want people to live fruitful and and healthy lives after boxing, but we want to see a war. Don't we all? And a guy like Alan Babic sets out to do that. Hey, man, I'm cheering for him. Hope you have a great fight against Eric Molina. This is Myron Magnus. See you next video. Peace and pugilism.